We're celebrating uh, two uh, very uh, important anniversaries. The first being the centennial of JFK's birth. This is the 100th centennial of JFK. So again, we're very excited that um, we can combine our Memorial Day ceremony, which we normally do, with the celebration and recognition of, of JFK's life. Being a Massachusetts boy, I've always been a fan of the Kennedys and John F. Kennedy in particular, and thought that it would be great to work with the town to really throw an incredible party for the president. To celebrate the centennial of JFK's birth, we have a number of events planned. There's sort of a film series at the Coolidge Corner Theater. We are screening two films. On the 22nd, we're running a 35 millimeter print of PT-109, and we're also screening Apollo 13 on Memorial Day itself. In addition to our regular birthday celebration that we always have on May 29th, this year we have some special uh, speeches prepared. And then refreshments and, and birthday cake. So during the whole month of May, we're doing um, Dine Like a Kennedy. Um, it, it's really the cuisine of the Kennedys. I tried to concentrate primarily on foods that John Kennedy ate as a boy, it's like shepherd's pie and beef stroganoff, fish chowder. The building's been around since the 20s. It became a theater in 1933 and has been a movie theater ever since. So there's a pretty great chance that the president saw films here. The Kennedys were just, you know, they were Brookline kids who went to devotion school and they grew up to uh, make great contributions to this country. I mean, he served on PT-109. PT boats were made of plywood. That's a light boat. You get shot, bullets are going through it. He was very heroic. His crew was very heroic. Another event that will be happening on May 29th in the evening is a 1960s saw cop. It's going to be really cool. We're doing 1960s retro food and cocktails and antique cars. It's from 7 to 10 on Memorial Day evening at Brookline High School. It's a really great day to just immerse yourself in history as well as remember heroes, both Kennedy and so many of his counterparts. And we want everybody to come out and help us celebrate JFK's centennial. And it's just, it's going to be a town-wide bash.